Ladakh. The far-flung eastern corner of Jammu and Kashmir. This is India's most remote and sparsely populated region. It's cut off from the rest of the world by snow for at least six months of the year. The high altitude and barren conditions makes growing food difficult, especially vegetables. Until recently, almost all fresh vegetables were brought in by road or air at prices which many Ladakhis couldn't afford. Rigzik Chondal lives in the village of Basgo. Like many women here, she couldn't afford to buy imported vegetables in the market. Maintaining a healthy and balanced diet was a constant struggle. But now the people of Ladakh can eat fresh vegetables in winter, which they have grown themselves. In these high, barren slopes, they're using local skills and natural materials to harvest the one resource they have plenty of, the power of the sun. This is a passive solar greenhouse. It is covered on the south side with pollen. Here, in these greenhouses, even when outside a temperature is minus 30 during a peak winter, it will not freeze inside. The west wall is painted white to reflect the morning sunlight. The other two walls are painted black to absorb heat, storing it overnight. And the thick insulation retains as much of this heat as possible. Simple ventilation prevents it from overheating in spring and summer. Rigsig and Chondal got her greenhouse three winters ago. She paid $200 and provided some of the materials. She's delighted with it. To say greenery in winter is very beautiful and striking. I feel like visiting the greenhouse two or three times a day, either to collect vegetables or just to take a look. Green vegetables taste better and the food looks exotic. The combination with rice is delicious. Vegetable momo is also good or it can be added to sku and chutagi for a better taste. As well as adding flavor to their meals, the year-round availability of vegetables has been a vital step towards a balanced diet. Before, many suffered from anemia due to iron and vitamin deficiencies, nutrients that green leaf vegetables can provide. It's meant a huge change for women like Rigzing, who can now provide all the fresh produce her family needs. And they can earn some extra money by selling any surplus vegetables. Greenhouse-grown vegetables sell for half the price of imported ones, earning good profits for the growers and saving money for everyone else. This means that for Rigzing, a long wait for the bus followed by a two-hour journey to market is well worthwhile. Key to the project's success is the way Geres and its NGO partner Leho promote the scheme. To construct a greenhouse, we gather all the villagers and explain to them the project in detail. And then after, among the villagers, they select uh, the people who are really interested to build greenhouses. We train the mason in the village how it will be built and all this, and also train all the greenhouse owners uh, so that they can run the greenhouse after properly. So this all knowledge remains in the village with the community, which really helps for the sustainability. The greenhouse is especially good for women to help them become economically self-sufficient and independent instead of asking men for money. We do not need to shy away from selling our own products in the markets. It's better selling them directly like this rather than putting money in the hands of vegetable vendors. I think providing these greenhouses for us is very useful. In the regional capital of Leh, it's market day. Rigzing comes here every two weeks to sell her surplus vegetables. This regular income has made a real difference to her and her family's lives. When there were no fresh vegetables, we had to buy pulses, meat and many other foods. This year, our costs have gone down. By selling the surplus vegetables, we make some money as well. 
and with this money we can pay for some of our household costs and we can buy notebooks and pencils for our children. When I see all these benefits, I feel inspired to do better and work harder and we are hoping that all our wishes will be fulfilled. Yeah,